Hello, happy 2024, happy new year. I wanted to share with you about my one word. Do you have a one word for the new year? Do you make resolutions? Do you make goals? Um, do you just get a journal and dream? Well, for the last several years, I've been doing a one word that serves as a theme throughout the whole year. And I also ask God for a scripture or a couple of scriptures to guide me through the new year. And a lot of times I don't feel I choose a word. I feel like God just impresses a word on me. So this year's is steadfast. And I looked at the definitions of these, of this word. Steadfast means resolutely or dutifully firm and unwavering. Webster's Dictionary Online says firmly fixed in place or immovable, not subject to change, firm in belief, determination, or uh, adherence, loyal. And the, the Hebrew word is chesed, C-H-E-S-E-D, pronounced chesed, and it refers to God's devout loving kindness, mercy, and faithfulness. So I feel the scripture he gave me for this year is James 1.12, and this is out of ESV. Blessed is a man or woman who remains steadfast under trial, for when he has stood the test, he will receive the crown of life which God has promised to those who love him. And I looked up in Strong's the word for steadfast, remaining steadfast, it's in Jer, Strong's G5-278, which is hoop omeno, and it means to stay under, to bear, to abide, to bear bravely or calmly, to not run, to not flee, to endure ill treatments, hold on to faith in Christ. And I looked at the word for test, and it's uh, pitting, pitting to, um, I'm sorry, uh, pitting to proof, temptation and adversity. Persevere, abide, bear bravely. So I actually didn't want this word. <laughs> a lot of times I don't want the word because I'm like, oh great, now I'm going to go through tests and trials in 2024. I've already been through that. I've already been through ill treatment, suffering, persevering, enduring, trials, tests, challenges. Don't want any more. Thank you very much. The other verse I felt God gave me was 1 Corinthians 15, 58, and I'll be blogging about this too, is, so my dear brothers and sisters, be strong and immovable. Always work enthusiastically for the Lord, for you know that nothing you do for the Lord is ever useless. And I looked at the Hebrew word for immovable, and it's hedrodno, hedrayo, sorry, and it's fixed in purpose, is Strong's G1476, fixed in purpose, firm, and settled. Basically, it's about keeping and standing in faith in Christ, no matter what comes, no matter what adversity, to be loyal to God, to be steadfast, because God is steadfast. God is loyal. He is faithful. He never changes. So what area do you and I need to be more steadfast in, to endure, to keep our eyes on Jesus and have faith in him? That's my question for you and me today, my challenge. Let me know what your warm word is or if you make goals, dreams, resolutions, if you sit down with a journal and just dream. But let's believe for a great new year in 2024 and keeping our eyes on God, being steadfast and trust and faith in Him. Be blessed and have a beautiful day. This is Beth at BethJones.net and I will talk to you later.